take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Because of how valuable working out is for lean muscle growth and overall health, we advise everyone to partake in some form of regular exercise. However, even if you are consuming protein shakes and not working out, it doesn't mean you'll gain weight. Take our lead. While protein shakes around workouts and between meals are helpful, make sure you're getting enough throughout the day. Both foods and supplements can help you meet your goals. For healthy people, there are little or no health risks associated with using protein shakes while following a high-protein diet. Take our lead. Whey protein is an incredibly versatile nutritional ingredient. Not only can it be used after workouts, but whey protein can also be consumed with breakfast, as a midday snack, with dinner and even right before bed. Let's help you make your mark. Whey protein is digested faster, providing instant MPS, making it a good post-workout drink. Soy and casein are digested slowly, prolonging MPS through the night. Casein protein is the slowest, making it the best for overnight recovery. Make your mark, take our lead. Alternatively, you could simply avoid whey protein and eat other protein-rich foods instead. But generally speaking, whey protein has an excellent safety profile and most people can consume it without problems. Whey protein is very safe. A commonly recommended dose is 1 to 2 scoops, 25 to 50 grams, per day. Make your mark, take our lead. This is due to the way the protein is grown and manufactured, and if you consume too much, you can experience high levels of toxins in your system. Anyone who takes a protein powder, or any supplement, needs to do their research and choose a third-party tested supplement, says Goodson. Make your mark, take our lead. If you consume too much of it, it will result in a weight gain. If you increase your protein intake, but would not like to gain any weight, you must decrease your intake of carbohydrates and or fats. If you want to lose weight, it is not enough just to increase your protein intake. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.